All right, the man of the hour, George Seifert. And we were just talking off camera as we were, as we were kind of reflecting and, and, and thinking of old stories. When you get an honor like this, does your career, does everything kind of like quickly flash before you? Well, it does because, you know, you have to make a little talk and obviously you've <laughs> got to have something to talk about. And, and so uh, you don't want to bore the audience too much by going back to junior high school, but maybe you can start with high school and then college <laughs> and go from there. Yeah, like, but, but right across from Kizar Stadium. Are you, you're relating a story that uh, there was a time where you thought, uh, geez, am I ever going to? Win a championship? No, that's true. I, I, the story we're, we were talking about was we were playing Balboa, uh, 1957 Thanksgiving. You were at Poly. I was at Poly, mm -hmm. and we were playing Balboa, and it was 1957 Thanksgiving morning, and we were at Kizar, and and I had this fellow uh, that I was tackling, and unfortunately we're both going into the end zone, and he happened to have obviously the ball, and he happened to have when he touched down as we went into the end zone, yeah. Not much fun. So I didn't know if I'd ever win a championship and then, you know, how fortunate I am to be here tonight uh, after being associated with a organization that won five championships. Yeah, 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 and, and, and speaking of tackling, you tackle the guy and, and he scored the winning touchdown. Isn't it funny? You, 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 you make your bones as a defensive coordinator for the 49ers before you became a head coach. And, and since that time in high school, I, I actually learned how to tackle. <laughs> okay. I, I was with some good coaches that taught technique very well uh, when, when I was at Utah and then coached at Utah and uh, and was able to then turn that over to the players that, that I was fortunate enough to coach with the 49ers. Some of them I didn't have to coach too much with regard to tackling because they were natural hitters like Ronnie Lott and Carlton Williams right. and et cetera. Well, on Monday Night Football against the Rams, uh, they certainly got the tackling down. Yeah, no, they, <laughs> that was a great win for the 49ers and and having grown up in San Francisco and Northern California, I never did like those Rams. <laughs> even yeah. even and, then, yeah, even crazy then. legs, Hirsch, and all those guys. Yeah, well, I kind of like crazy legs. Okay, I, I have to admit, I like that. But I, um, you know, in fact, I became a. a, a I've always been an avid fisherman, but a hunter as well. And and one of my prizes is getting a grand slam of Rams. There so you there's go. five of them. Okay, and I got all five. <laughs> yeah, that's great. That's right. terrific. Terrific. Uh, the Super Bowl runs. I mean, I, I'm sure in conversation, probably 30 seconds elapsed before it, boom, it comes up. But there's just something about that and just the, the, the allure and the, the almost hushed tones when people bring up that and the 49ers. And to be a part of it, George. No, and, 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 yeah. And, and like I said before, you know, having grown up in the city and, yeah. and uh, we never quite made it. We got close a few times. The 49ers did. And uh, then to, to wind up... Uh, you know, coaching defensive backs and then defensive coordinator, and then as the head coach, to be a part of that is, you know, I'm blessed. Can you sit back and watch a 49er game without really kind of looking at it, maybe as a coach, just going, well, they, they missed this and they, they had this scheme here. That, is, 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 it, is it tough to detach from being a coach? It's been a while <laughs> since I, and so I've had a lot of time to detach. Okay. And uh, so I enjoy the game. I mean, there's some things, you know, you notice and you say, oh my gosh, you got to watch out for this or that, but that's just instinctive. And, and uh, now, now I just enjoy watching the teams and, and I enjoy watching Coach Shanahan, who I was, you know, worked with his dad when I was coaching with the 49ers. And then to see how well he's done with his career, it's special. You know, Kyle Shanahan was a, he was like a little boy, ball boy, kind of, kind of running I, around the practice I, field. I vaguely remember, but I do remember. <laughs> Absolutely, yeah. And the legend continues. Say hey, thanks so much, Coach. Hey, Thank congratulations. You. Thank you very much.